Okay. Summit, can you see me? Yes. Okay, perfect. Okay, am I good here? Mm hmm All right, ready? Mm hmm Colorado Springs and I literally got here and I saw while looking at the mountains like they're just so beautiful. I'm so happy to be here. focus but I just want to do a little check-in so we spent yesterday and most of today in Colorado Springs and in that area we went to the Garden of the Gods we went to the Red Rock like open space area and we went to um, the Mueller State Park yesterday which was really really pretty it was raining and we just like sat in the car it was really really nice um, but we just finished up showering at Planet Fitness which felt so good it felt so good to take a shower and feel clean and then we went to the Red Rock open space and now we are heading up north towards Denver where we're gonna go do the the Lost Pond, the Lost Lake Trail and we're gonna head up towards like the Rocky Mountain State Park and stuff like that so I can't wait, I'm really ready for that. We just made it to the Rocky Mountain National Park. We ended up going to the Wild Basin area to hike today and we saw two waterfalls. It's absolutely gorgeous. some food affirmations and kind of set myself up for the meal my mom is still sleeping we checked into a hotel sorry that was so all over the place let me try that one more time i'm about to sit down and have my food i'm gonna do some food affirmations and just calm my nerves before i eat because as you can tell i'm very all over the place right now but um yeah so last night we actually checked into a hotel that my grandparents got for us um, we got into the city and we realized there's not really a place to stay to sleep in the car Whenever you're in the city, the gas stations are either like right in the middle of like Denver Which is kind of dangerous to be in whenever you're sleeping in your car So we my grandparents got us a hotel because they were really worried about us Which I'm so grateful for this place is really nice and as you can see they have like a little sweet style set up So I made some delicious food. I'm just gonna say my little affirmations so thank you thank you thank you for blessing my body and for nourishing me with all of the most wonderful nutrients that i need thank you for digesting easily and turning directly into the fuel that i need to share more love with the world i'm so grateful for all that it took to get you to me Thank you for growing specifically for me and thank you to all of the people who processed you and who got you on my plate and, or on my, in my bowl. Thank you. So. Mm. Mm. My food affirmations just help me be a lot more intentional with what I'm eating because I've struggled with eating in the past. I've struggled with like overeating, with under eating, so just like all over the place but whenever i started implementing these affirmations into my daily meals it really helps me to just sit with the food and appreciate it as a source of fuel and a source of energy rather than something to control or to try to i, I don't know just something to control because now it's just it's just a bowl of love like it's a bowl of energy i can eat 
whatever I want and now that I've decided that like I eat whatever I want to eat I only want to eat things that are good for my body and saying these affirmations help me to differentiate and be like is this a source of love and fuel that I actually want to go into my body or is this gonna make me feel like crap or just those kinds of things so it's really helped me to just be more intentional I actually found those affirmations on Hitomi's channel. I look up to her so much. And so if you want some more affirmations and some more like what I eat in a day videos, she has a lot. Pretty. Happy sunset. How are your chips? Good? Good. <laughs> Good. Safest area to have a picnic. Yeah, it's probably not, but that's okay. Yeah. We'll be fine.